Welcome on back, guys, to some more Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. So, I did some cooking. We are now topped up on cold food. Uh, I only had enough of the extra hearts to do a plus two. Uh, if I was smarter... Whoops. Let's actually do some of this real quick. Uh, what do we got here? Four minutes. Um, if I was smarter... I wouldn't have wasted a lot of those heart or extra heart foods. That's really cool, the moon going down. I wouldn't have wasted a lot of those extra heart foods on that Lionel. Because once I kind of figured out the strategy, it was really just about patience. So we've got we got a shrine over there, and we have a shrine here. That is It's where we're trying to get to Rito Village. I think. I don't remember what that was. At this. It wasn't the Lionel that we marked. I can feel like we need to go figure out what that was. There's a road around here. Okay, here's a road. There's a Korok puzzle down there. Let's go hit that real quick. Maybe it's not. I thought it was a Korok puzzle, but it's just uh, rock sticking out. Alright, so we got something up there. All right, let's just climb real quick. We'll put on our, um, put on our climbing stuff. Let's see if we can get up there fairly quickly. Then we can always just glide down to that shrine as well. But if this is a shrine, then yay. And this guy. Man, that I tell you what, that Lionel fight was a really good fight. I really had fun doing that. And going to Hyrule Castle, picking up those shields, definitely worth it. I wish there was a way you could kind of check and see what the durability is left on your shield, but I mean, that royal shield that we have on our back right now, I mean, that thing just took a beating. That wasn't even our best shield, so that's fantastic. Yeah, because we've got... Yeah, we've got a Royal Guard shield, but that Royal shield, man, that thing... That thing came in clutch. Be nice once we do get to Rito Village. make exploring up here a lot easier because we don't have to keep popping food all the time because we can get some clothes wow oh, it was okay one of these glyphs i think right this one is really weird it's like it's that over there You see that? It's like something hanging on the side over here. Oh, well, is this like a Korok thing? Where would we get that, though? Oh, I bet we, we just have to shoot it with a bow, right? Yeah, I think that's how we get it. Now uh, we can... I just go back to this bow for now. Uh -huh. We did find you. All right, now we gotta. I mean, we're here. We might as well find our dragon tier. I feel like the dragon tier's got to be like 
up here on top. It's not going to be somewhere like on the side where we can't really get it. Oh, yeah. All right, let's see what's going on here. やはり素敵なんてなくても私はすぐに信じたわよ、ナウル。彼女からは私の力とあなたの光の力何より同じ血のエニシを感じるもの。So like Zelda is like an ancient ancient ancestor these guys. 先ほど一刻も早く元の時代に戻らなければいけないと言っておられたが。はい。私の時代では大変なことが起こっていて。早く戻らねばならないのに、そのすべがここにどうやって来たのかさえ何もわからなくて。ねえ、ゼルダさん。とにかく一度落ち着かなきゃ。私たちのお城においでなさい。いえ、それは。みんなには私の遠い縁者として紹介するわ。ゆっくりと考えれば知恵も浮かぶわ。ありがとうございます。そうだ。ミネルなら時を超える術を心得ておるやも知れぬ。ミネルさん。ああ。誰よりもゾナウの英知を知り尽くし、我らと同じ秘跡を携えし者。私の姉だ。Okay. <gasps> right, so So I don't think and every time we do a dragon tier, it's just for whatever whatever memory is in that region. They're not, uh, you know, we don't just pick them and then the game applies them in order. Because that, that one we just watched, she still had her clothes on from... <laughs> From our time period, but the one that we saw a couple episodes ago, she had clothes on from that period, and then they said, "Hey, let's go, let's go take you to change into some fresh clothes." So, I wonder if there is. I mean, I would definitely rather experience the story in order. I mean, the cutscenes in order. 
So I wonder if there's any rhyme or reason to where we go and when we do it. Let's kind of take a look at the quest log. I don't know, though, because uh, um, Pura, like, right away was like, hey, here's, like, four points to go check out. And one of them was up here. And she didn't really say go here first, but I can remember. Like, in Breath of the Wild, I'm pretty sure it was like, hey, Kakariko Village, oh, there's a stable down there. Um, is that? Yeah, I think that's Rito Village right there. Okay. Yeah, it is. Cool. Um, So let's go. We're going to go hit this shrine. I don't know if we're going to be able to work our way back to that other one, because I want to go check out that stable, because I think that's where... The crap is going on down here. Like a little note from somebody. Because hmm. um, I want to go check out, because I think the Rito Stable is where the uh, Lucky Clover Gazette is. And hopefully that will provide some answers on how we can, you know, what we have to do to kind of move mus the musician. Ugh. How we can move the musicians over to the fairy fountains so we can get those activated and be able to use them. All right, what do we got here? A launching device, okay. this stuff oh rockets oh so I mean so we messed around with these a little bit um, a couple episodes ago when we found um, there was that Goron who had the uh, kind of the whack a hammer game I want to do this one I mean, if we just do like this, will that, uh, okay. so yeah, we played with them a little bit. I think rockets are going to be, I mean, I seriously, I really would. One of these next couple episodes, I'll have to just, uh, just start doing stuff. Just going around and, you know, messing around building things. So are there... Oh, I bet we have to, uh, do we have to get them from here? Yeah. Hmm. Let's actually bring... Both. Whoops. Do that. We'll bring both of them. And what do we got going on here? It's just a back and forth. That is up and over. Is one rocket enough? And if we... We just do like this? Is that enough? Let's try it. I don't know if it'll send us off kilter either. Oh, it does. But... We made it. Okay, there's a chest up there. 
If we so we can launch a mine cart. Straight up in the air. And in the center here. Center, so maybe if we I feel like we're gonna we're gonna want this to be centered. Going so much higher. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Ah, it's just gonna flip it. Is it because of the rockets, like, kind of dragging it down or something? Right here? Here? Well, I mean, let's see what happens. Oh, crap. Man. So that's exactly what we wanted. I just uh didn't jump in time or something. Like right there at the bottom. I'm going to go down here at the bottom, right? Hey, that looks pretty good. How much room do we have? You just go like right here. Should do it. Oh, you can't you can't jump when you're falling down. Well, that's weird. So how does that work? Get weird. I'm just curious what's going to happen here. <laughs> oh my crap, we're getting low on hearts. Oh, that was awesome. Um, that was pretty cool. So, you gotta
I, I uh, feel like I'm just kind of messing around a little bit right now. Cool. <laughs> uh, Ruby, we'll take it. Is that our? That's our only treasure in here. All right. Tally ho. Yeah, I think I think rockets are pretty cool. I still would like, uh, like I know we have those wheels that like power themselves or whatever. Um, but it'd be nice to have, I don't know if we eventually get like steerable wheels or something, because really hard to control that stuff. Rockets are pretty powerful, though. I wonder if we could use those. I, I was mentioning a while ago that it'd be nice if we had, like, a Rivali's Gale type thing where we could just launch ourselves in the air. Well, I wonder if rockets kind of fill that that purpose somehow. All right, that other shrine. Oh, yeah. Cold now. That other shrine was... What's that? It was all the way over there. What's that? Okay. All right, yeah, let's just... We'll do this stable down here, then. Where'd that go? Stable go. There it is. Actually, no, wasn't there, like... There's something somewhere. A little tent or something. Ah, yes, this. What do we got going on, gentlemen? A big ass cave, looks like. Uh. What's going on? Ah. If you want some bright caps, oh. I got a crap ton. Oh. I got a lot. Nice. Spicy tomato mushroom stew. Sounds delicious. Oh. Your secret. Ah. <laughs> ah. North. Okay. Oh. <laughs> All right. So. Cave mushrooms that glow. Oh, that's complete. Oh, that was their tent then. And they packed up and moved the fuck on. Where were that? Well, let's see. I don't think. We've got enough time to conquer this cave, so I'm gonna let me put a stamp here. All right, yeah, let's put a stamp here. Let's put like 
that for like a cave door. And then we shall go and check out the stable. Seven. <laughs> hey, Lucky Clover Gazette. Fantastic. There's all this stuff. Pinecone, flint. Double it all up. Oh, what do we have here? Well, it's uh, that reporter guy. Mm -hmm. I'm next in charge. Yes. It wasn't too bad. What, Tracy? Is that from, uh... I can't remember what it was called. Like, Tracy's something from the first game. It was, like, reviews of areas or something. Oh! Oh! Ah? Mutually beneficial agreement. Oh. Is I the new applicant? Uh. Yes. What do you got from the back? <laughs> what is that stuff? Like swimming clothes or something? Froggy armor? Hey, hey, hey. All right. I'll take it. Every stable. So, can I turn in information? Ma? So I guess I can't uh, turn in anything that I discovered previously archives are currently closed okay what's this oh so archives archives okay yeah this looks pretty cool <laughs> great if you need to stay on the lookout from unexpected places Wow. 
stand out there and spoon up the news. Love it. All right, guys, we're going to call this episode here. Uh, in the next one, we're going to poke around uh, Lucky Clover Gazette just a little bit more and then kind of figure out what our next direction is going to be. Uh, actually, no, scratch that. We know our next direction. We're going to go over to um, Rito Village and we're going to get some cold resistant clothes and then we'll figure out where we need to go. So if you guys are enjoying the content, please hit that like button. Give me a thumbs up and we will catch you next time for some more Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Have a great rest of your day.